now that we know that in order for us to really embrace content marketing, we need to do two things, which is tie our results to sales, think like a marketer. We know that we have to start collaborating with marketing uh, much more closely and sales and other or parts of the organization. We can't be so siloed. Content marketing really has three components and they all have different skill sets. Um, content strategy, content creation, and content promotion. And, you know, I've heard a couple of people in the, in the conference say that PR should own content strategy or content marketing because we, you know, are good, at, good writers and good storytellers. And what I believe is that everyone has different skill sets. And PR definitely has a stake, but let's look at the different categories and think, where are our strengths, where are marketing strengths, and what can we really own? So, we're all natural storytellers. We're good at building relationships, but marketing trumps us when it comes to generating leads and driving website traffic. We've been positioning companies and executives of thought leaders since the beginning of time, or at least the beginning of PR. In marketing circles, though, um, marketers call, are just now starting to call this thought leadership marketing. And it's just now becoming a topic of conversation in marketing circles, which makes me kind of laugh because I see these articles talking about, so we're still trying to define thought leadership. I'm like, well, but PR has been doing thought leadership forever. So that's where we are strong. Um, but we do fall behind in areas like customer acquisition and sales support. So when it comes down to it, if we're going to own content marketing, we need to realize that everyone else besides us thinks content marketing is about driving sales for the organization and lead generation. That's why companies are spending money on it. So if we want to be part of that conversation and driving that, we need to embrace lead generation and sales. Building awareness, check, got that down. Um, but one of the things we struggle with is getting people to take immediate action, even if it's something as simple as coming to our website. Marketing, however, really good at that. So PR professionals, you know, we're good at educating audience, audiences. Um, marketing's good at sales. So we clearly have a number of strengths that um, will enable us to really play in the content marketing game. If we're going to really own content marketing, we need to, you know, build up our marketing, our marketing strengths because it does have that keyword in it, marketing. So this is an opportunity. So right now, if we think, where does PR fit in content marketing? Where's our opportunity to stake our claim? Top of the funnel, you know, square, square fit. Uh, middle of the funnel, open opportunity because marketer, nobody's doing this or doing it well. Very few. And so let's take our claim there.